feeling fantastic. Okay, Carlo? Visit Barry Kind of like Sporting you shake yourself. Today. Ah, get bent. Big moment, huh? Finally running with the pack. Listen, I spend more time with a dime than all you've put together. Sure. Sure. Sat out on the road, wait till he's finished with his rod. <laughs> I wonder. I won't. It's fine. Boss doesn't have to know. Why are you coming? The boss said you're coming. Just you got a face like you're being taken for an airing. I don't want Gates thinking we're frails. Why is Out. Sarah Morello anyways? First time Gates pulled in with his trucks, Morello decided to change up the terms. The big guy himself popped him in the nose as part of their renegotiation. This nose is going to get more than a pop if Morello hears we're involved. That's why we're pretending to stick him up. Then he'll go back to his pop and tell a sob story about being robbed at gunpoint. He'll convince his old man that Morello can't protect the merchandise. They'll need to find a new buyer out here and he's heard of a stand-up guy named Salieri. This plan is some bullshit, Tom. Polly told it to me yesterday, and somehow it's gotten worse. Hey, when you get a lead for the boss, and you don't just drive him places, then, then you get to pick holes. So then, shut your damn mouth. Ah, whatever helps you sleep. When Morello tracks you down, don't come crying to me. You serious? You actually serious? Fellas, knock it off. Christ. This Carlo guy is getting on my nerves, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, I don't mind having a fresh face in our crew, but he really is nagging the living hell out of my nerves. This is Lover of Ladies here, like my video, share my video, leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys, but most importantly, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. That way you'll be able to get daily gaming content from me. And hit that notification button as well. So you know when I upload my videos. And speaking of uploading. By the time this video is on my channel. It would be on 4th of July. So happy 4th of July everyone. Thank you for taking your time out to actually watch my video during this holiday. And I pretty much appreciate your love and support. So right now, let's get to possible action, maybe? Who knows? At this point, I'm expecting the worst, but hoping for the best. And we're here. Nice. Do a lot of deals here. Parking attendant don't ask for much dough. Always closes up shop till I'm done. Okay, we're good. Gates is waiting up on the top floor. Top floor? Are you kidding me? That means if we have to do a possible getaway, it's going to be hard going up and down these floors without crashing. And look how narrow it is. You know, this reminds me of the parking garage at my job. Nine to five, place is deserted. Well, we got jobs and we're here. That kind of a job, sure. I'm not really feeling this area. I don't know. Maybe it's the cynic in me, but I'm getting some bad vibes yeah, already. Gates, Bowie. Only that he's got a bust up nose and crates full of the good stuff. Our kind of guy. Our kind of guy. We're on the top floor already? That's pretty fast. Park up over there. Okay. So right here exactly. Alright. Polly! Good to see you, pal. Yeah, you too, Gates. Well, I hope you all have good taste in whiskey. I ain't really the expert here. Tommy. What kind of whiskey is it? I bet it's that Jack Daniels Tennessee honey. Oh, yeah. It's fine. Your first payment. If the Don's impressed, he'll finance more runs. And each one's going to be bigger than the last. We're all going to be rich, boys. Well, we are always happy to do business with good folks like Don Salieri. Please, give him my regards. Sure thing. Now we just got to conclude this transaction. 
What's that? What? No, no. It's okay. Oh, what? I told you we got to make it look like a proper robbery. Damn thing's going to be crooked by the time I'm done with this city. Ah, don't worry, pal. With all the dough you're raking in, you're going to be able to pay for a new one. <laughs> oh, that was expected. Who is that? Hey, yo, I knew something crazy was going to happen. I knew it. I knew it. Oh, wow. This is horrible. Horrendous. Oh, I ran out. I ran out. How do I switch? Cool. Okay. The, how the hell do they know about this? Because you always shoot your mouth off. They took a bullet. You got be kidding me. Wait, hold on. Let me see if I can get some bullets. I need some. Oh, man. Listen, I know what you're thinking. You really jinxed it. No, it's my intuition. I knew something happened. I knew something look. bad was going to happen. My guys will come for me. No, go, go, go. So long as you guys clear him out up ahead, I'll be safe here with the little guy. Oh, my Our gosh. He is so me. sweet you know, and dead. innocent. Right, check for more of them. This thing ain't over. All right, let's go. What do I have to do? Escort the... Okay, so... I'll escort, I guess, right? No? Do I really have to walk my way through? Are you kidding me? Oh, this is gonna suck. Okay. We got more of them. Oh shit. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. There you go. There you go. Come on. I can't even shoot for my life at this point. Okay, he's dead. Let me see if I can get some. Thank you. What the hell? Come here. Pull up. Oh, that car. That car is smoking. Last thing I need is for that thing to blow up. Where you at? Okay. We should be good. Right? Oh, this sucks. Thank goodness I'm able to recover some ammo. It still sucks, though. I'm not gonna lie. This whole thing is just... Oh, no. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. There you go. Oh! 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 What? This guy's on fire. I'm not even gonna bother. They're on fire. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, I got it. Oh, this is crazy. I don't know if there's a way through the fence. Ooh, I'm not going over here. Sorry, I'm not trying to die. Can I do something with this? No, okay. Turn on the sprinklers. I'm trying, but I don't even know how. This sucks. Hold on. Can I get in here or no? How would I get in? Find a way in, Tom. I'll stick with the truck. I'm trying. There's no way for me to get in whatsoever. Ooh, never mind. Never mind. Ooh, I am literally dying. I should have never. Duh, I should have went through this way. Okay. Is there a way for me to get up? No, there is not. So I guess there's a way for me to go down, right? Oh my goodness. Who's there? Oh shit, you gotta be kidding me. 
This sucks. I am dying. Let me just take a few breathers quickly. Hello? Anyone here? Nice. Oh, sweet. Thank goodness. Finally. A way in. Let me go get some first aid kid, too. I'll take that, thank you. Ooh, what is that? Ooh, a comic book! Yes! Terror Tales. Hmm, interesting. Alright, who else? Come on, you kidding me? Damn. Yeah, I know. Oh, that was Polly. Got one. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. I got this. I got this. I'm trying to see if there's any way for me to get... There you go. There you go. There you go. Is someone begging for their life? Because I couldn't care less. I hope you know that. Probably at this point. This is really intense. I'm surprised I have yet to die. We should be good, right? Yeah, we should be good. Watch my back. Sure, see him. Nice. Let's go. Did Morello hear about my deal? All kinds of beefers in this city. For now, let's get the booze back to the warehouse and try not to die. Seriously, that is such an understatement at this point. Oh no, come on, man. Okay, I'm gonna bumper car them. Oh sh There you go. Come on. I'm gonna keep on shooting them too. Until their car wears out. There you go. Come on. Bingo. One down. Two down. Perfect. Are we even close to our hideout? Because this truck here... Barely holding on, dear life. There you go. Bump car, let's go. Ooh, nice. Sick. What? Oh, shit. That's not... That is so not good. Oh, man. The ghetto. The ghetto. Let's go. Oh, my goodness. This is horrible. Oh my gosh, these cars. All I know is by the time we get back to our place, the mechanic is definitely going to spend hours fixing this car. Or junking it, to be honest. Bye, get out, get out. Nope, they're like cockroaches at this point. As long as they're behind us, hitting this red car, we should be good. This is insane. I'm just surprised that the cops have yet to come out with all the ruckus and noise that we're making right about now throughout the whole town. We lost them all. Thank Christ for that. Let's head home. See what we got. We got the booze. I mean, I know it didn't go to plan, but we got the booze. Yeah. So tonight, me and you are gonna drink a bunch of it. I guess we earned that one. Yeah, baby, we're home. Let's go. Woo. That was intense, I'm not gonna lie. Looks like a 38. Morello's boys caught up with you? Yeah, boss. We took care of it. 
What about the kid from Kentucky? Uh, he took a slug to the shoulder, but uh, he's a tough blocker. He and his crew dusted out as soon as we bumped off Morello's hatchet man. Getting shot will give Gates and his pop another reason to ice Morello out of the whiskey business. Well, let's see if this hooch was worth all the trouble. Take a sip. Let me know. It tastes good to me. Excellent. I'll work out the details with Papa Gates. But once we're running this Kentucky Brown, we'll be back in brass buttons. Good work, son. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of all of you. Saludo. Saludo. Sounds like Salieri was getting ready to make his move. Waking up to him, maybe. But then, prohibition ended. And a bootlegging business got knocked on its ass. We were fighting over booze, man, next to nothing. It took us a few years to recover. But when we did bounce back, boy, it was something. I feel like I'm in the episode of an A&E biography. Whiskey and invested into no records. Some of them even legal. Construction, restaurants, trucking, gambling. We branched out into everything. Except peddling dope. By 35, things were looking up. We had good money rolling in on the regular. I had a wife and daughter. Sam was running a club for the Don. Even Paulie had a few records of his own. Wasn't exactly happy, but... What do you call it? Uh, content. Yeah. That was it. And Celieri, he finally starts talking about getting out of Morello's shadow. Maybe buying our own cops, our own politicians. Hmm. That's interesting. You think Salieri was sourcing high binders in 34? Maybe. Wait. Well, a few years back, the voice squad got a judge on solicitation of a minor. Wait, the what? He started confessing all sorts of misbehaving, trying to get a deal. But he copped to taking kickbacks from Rollo and your man Salieri. Playing him off one another, trying to goose the take, but once Morello found out, he threatened to bury the judge's kids on the beach, still breathing, of course. Christ. It was the missing piece. How was that? Morello was always winding us up, but he never did anything that might start an all-out war. Learning Celieri was building his own bench must have finally tipped his scales, because in 35, he hit us with both barrels. Bon appetit, baby. Well, his pasted it on his face. Hey, oh, hey, boss. What's going on? I'm glad you're here. There you go, boss. You want a Pepe's for lunch, but Carlo called in sick. You up for a drive? Sure, boss. Bravo. I'm already starving. I want to come, too. What are we eating? You got a piece on you? Yeah. Think I'll need it. Eh, you know how it is. Things with Morello have been a little quiet lately. Maybe it's just got me jumpy, is all. Nah, it's because you know something bad's gonna happen. Holy cow, look at that nice car. Woo, I would love to drive a nice little car like this. What a beauty. So how's business, Tom? Hey, you know how it is. It's good. Sure, I know the business. I see the books every day, but since what happened happened i know that a capo needs to talk to his soldiers without some other guy getting in the way i guess we'll mix him with a better sort of person though and i like dealing with all these big shots we got on the pad anything's better than those grifters trying to shift their hooch before the 21st went through ah this is only the start of it tom i got plans plenty of good people lining up for this a slice glad to hear it I know, leave me alone. I'm not gonna drive proper in this game, so. Listen, I gotta admit though, we should bring back these types of cars. I'm not gonna lie. Look at this beauty. I love this shape. It feels like I'm sailing with a big boat. Conversation, boss. I'll give you that. 
Sure I am. Me, Sam, and Polly, though. We're still real tight. We've been through some times together. Yeah, don't I know it. I would rather drive a classic car than these plastic ones with wires any day. Honestly, they're durable, they last longer, and I feel like they have a lot more class compared to the newer cars today. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's pretty cool with some of the electrical features like DVD, like, you know, CDs, being able to watch movies with DVDs in some cars, but nothing beats a nice classic car like this. Damn, damn, woo! I need to relax with the brakes. So basically, we're still in the Great Depression. Hopefully by the time the 40s rolls around, we should be able to just drive, but I don't know. It seems like it's either one thing or another when it comes to bad luck. You're going to love this wine. It's a... Don't so yeti. Welcome, my friend. Welcome. <laughs> Good to see you, Pepe. Yes. Hey, come. Our guest has arrived, huh? What's and he did ask day? me if I brought my peas, so... so Wouldn't that be, like, foreshadowing of something? I feel like it is. And to drink a Chianti. I've been saving this just for you. Yeah, bene, bene, bene. Okay. Uh, enjoy, huh? I'm glad you're off the rough, Tom. Uh, Sarah threatened to leave me if I didn't dry out. I know. She told you. No. I put her up to it. Wait, what? Drunkards get sloppy, Tom. I didn't want you to make a mistake we couldn't live with. So you went inside my marriage to try and influence her to get me to do stuff. Before you? You ain't Before shit. You. <laughs> Peppy, the meal is a masterpiece as always. <laughs> Molto grazie, Don Salieri. Praise from such a gourmet as you, it filled me with a joy. Uh, you wouldn't call me a gourmet if you knew what I had for supper. <laughs> Is that... I know something bad was gonna happen! What?! What the hell?! Morello! Bastard could've at least let me finish my wine! So you were expecting a retaliation, hey, right? That's why you asked me if I had my piece. Come on. We'll make this quick. Smoke them out, Joe. This is horrible. Look at that. And a dynamite? No, a grenade. Sorry. Wow, a grenade, bro. And I feel sorry for the owner of this Peppa's restaurant. All of his hard work. Shambles up in flames because of this man right here. We aren't going out the front door. Can you move? Not fast enough. We're gonna ambush these boys. I'll keep them entertained while you slip out the back and circle around. You sure, boss? This is disgusting. I'm so angry. Not one of them goes home tonight. Okay, boss. Be careful. Tom. Just be quick about it. Says them bye. The audacity. <gasps> Yo, you. Oh my goodness, that pisses me off, bro. Bye. I'll take that comic book, thank you. Wow, this is horrible. 
The way that they just killed the chefs and everything. That pisses me off. You know, I'm not gonna lie, this Mafia life is not for me. Come on. Come on. Pull up. Whatever, man. What? Come on. Oh, he's on fire. That's so cute. Burn, baby, burn! I can't aim for nothing, and I literally have no more bullets. You got any bullets? Thank you, thank you. Do you have any other guns, though? No? Ooh, thank you. I needed this. Finally, I got back up. Oh, this is horrible. Come on, man. There you go. There you go. Horrible. Horrible. Yes, I'm gonna need that tummy gun. I'm gonna need all of that, honestly. Look at that shit. There you go. Come on. Pull through. I bet you did. Jerk. Horrible. Come here. There you go. Come on. There you go. Don't sell Yuri. Boss, it's clear. Come on. Oh, look at the balls on this kid. You really saved my ass, Tom. We gotta go, boss. The cops will be here soon. I need a minute to catch my breath. A minute? A lot can happen in a minute. Well, let me get you back to the bar. No, not the bar. We're going to see Carlo. That son of a bitch knew where I was going today, and he calls in sick. He set you up. <sighs> oh, I knew it. You could have ended up just as dead. Yeah, I know, boss. Carlos I knew that Carlo's guy is Let's suspicious. Let's go see what he has to say about all this. Wow. I knew Carlos was suspicious. Step on it, Tom. Every minute Carlo's still breathing is a minute that's got me pissed. Sure, boss. I can't believe these bastards had the brass balls to wreck my car. Oh no, the cops. Carlo, didn't it? His pop was tight with Morello right when we started out. Apple don't fall far from the tree, huh? I wept that his funeral. And his sons will be laughing loud. His mom's already a widow, Tom, and now he's gonna make her lonely till the day she dies. For what? Some dota by his dope? And my foot through his face. No I way. just feel bad for the restaurant I'm owner. Glad this happened. I get what? To plug another rat. And we finally go to the mattresses with Morello. Today's the day that you know. Jesus, not now. We gotta get to Carlo. I'm sorry, man. What do you expect? I don't know. It's like this whole life is not worth it, honestly. But it's kind of like karma on his end. I mean, are you really gonna get away with doing a lot of bad things and not get any consequences? I'm glad this happened. I get to plug another rat, and we finally go to the mattresses with Morello. Today's the day that damn breaks. Sure feels like it. All right, we're here. Why don't you let me go first, huh? Carlo might be waiting for us. No, Tom, my face is going to be the first and last thing this bastard sees. Oh, really? What the fuck? You goddamn dirty grifter. You better dangle, sweetheart. It's gonna be a closed casket, Carlo. Damn. There goes his rules. Damn. Oh, you okay, bus? Yeah, just a little. Let me catch my breath. Jesus, he's fast for a big guy. Don't let him get away! 
Look at him running around. Foolish. Come on. Gray, I have to chase him? Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.